Yeah, I'm not just fighting for myself, I'm fighting for all artists. They never thought that this performer, myself, would outthink them. After everything that has occurred, it is safe to declare that freedom of expression exists only when what is said fits the narrative of the people who rule the world. If you disagree with them, you will be cancelled or deemed insane. Kanye West has been at the center of a media storm in recent weeks after numerous companies severed connections with him following an anti-Semitic statement. They claimed that the tweet was overly provocative. But is that really the case? Looking at the big picture, you might realize that there is a clique of powerful individuals out to silence those who speak their minds, especially if what you're saying impacts the powerful people who rule the globe. Which is a little frightening because at the end of the day we all have the right to say whatever we want. What instrument are you using to measure your argument if you say I'm wrong? From the other side, 6 is 9. Could it be that we're looking at things from different perspectives? It's possible. This isn't a new phenomenon. Michael Jackson was equally put in the same spot when he attempted to expose certain people. Look at Kanye West and Michael Jackson. They're both talking about freedom. They're very angry at me because of it, but um, I just did good business, you know. The way they get revenge is to try and destroy my album. Stop killing the art. The artists are supposed to express themselves to be able to have that eternal three-year-old at all costs. Both want their people to be free. No one would be more disturbed by such movements than an oppressor. They don't want to hear the truth because they believe it will awaken a large number of people. Having said that, those who continue to believe Kanye West is insane may be misled by the public and the media. Consider why they are concerned about a lunatic. We see a lot of weird people on the street, but we ignore them. Why would you cancel a crazy person? Nothing makes sense. If Michael Jackson was alive today, he would be overjoyed for Kanye West. In some ways, this is exactly what he wanted.